Hi, I'm Matthew Izzo, and welcome to my store. We are the store for people with ADD. You can come in here and get your haircut, furnish your home, and pick out a new outfit all at the same time. It's a lifestyle store. Right. Just give me a big smile right there. <laughs> I am super excited to be part of this campaign. Uh, I was really flattered when they asked me. Um, being such a part of the gay community here in Philadelphia, I figured, wow, I'm just honored, and I'm so proud to do it. Go. Nice. I've seen this neighborhood change in so many ways over the last few years. I've been here like six years now. And when I came, the gay community was pretty small here in Philly. It was here, but it was more underground. Over the past few years, it's become a lot more noticeable. The marketing's gotten better, the budgets have gotten bigger, the restaurants are better, the you know, shopping is better. We really kind of built a real, like, strong gay community here in Philadelphia. Philadelphia government has been amazing about supporting our neighborhood and, and you know, marketing our neighborhood. And they put up these great rainbow signs, so you kind of know where the neighborhood is. It's a very comforting environment around here. I feel like it's a safe, great neighborhood. Wonderful. Well, I go out Good. a lot, hang out at Bump a lot. Um, I kind of know everybody that works there. It's kind of my little local cheers. It was such a great transition coming from New York, which it's more transient in New York, and people tend to be a little bit more guarded. Um, so Philly was like this warm, comfortable place to go out. And I really found it to be a really pleasant surprise. I think every gay community is a small town. It's, you know, we all kind of know each other. And it's a good thing. It's like family. I mean, I see the same people on the street every day. And I know them and I say hi. And it's, I feel like I live in, in a real community. One, two, three, good.